anger at the headquarters of Egypt's Coptic Orthodox Church. Men and women protesting a court ruling allowing divorced Coptic men to remarry. No to violating the Bible. No to the marriage of sinners, they chanted. The Coptic community was taken by surprise last week when the church lost its appeal in front of a high court. The senior tribunal backed a 2008 ruling approving the request by two divorcees to remarry. The head of the church, Pope Shenouda III, and 90 other priests reacted swiftly. They signed a declaration dismissing the court's decision as irrelevant. Divorce and remarriage are accepted in Islam, the faith of the majority in Egypt, but are not allowed by the Coptic Church except in rare cases, specifically where adultery is proven. Marriage for us is sacred. It's fundamentally a religious act, not an administrative affair. If anyone in the country appeals a ruling issued against them, we can't tell them you're acting like a state within a state. The state cannot tell us to contradict our faith and conscience. However, critics of the Pope contend that one of the reasons the Church may be angered by this verdict is because it challenges attempts by the Church to have full control over the affairs of the Christian community, which makes up 10% of Egypt's population. Megdi William is one of the two divorcees the court granted the right to remarry. He says he's been fighting the Church for 17 years, first to have a divorce and then to move on. The church hasn't been transparent with me and has had double standards. They granted my ex-wife permission to remarry, but have been completely stubborn with me and without declaring any reasons. I'm not a monk, I just want to live. They can't expect me to be a saint or live in celibacy. He says church officials are refusing to carry out the verdict because that would set a precedent for the thousands of cops seeking divorce. But observers say the case underscores the underlying tension between the church and the state. Copts have long complained about discrimination. The calm between the Muslim and Christian communities is often described as fragile and erupts in violence every now and then, particularly over tribal affairs. All eyes now are on the government and its next step, namely whether President Hosni Mubarak will personally intervene. And with the Pope threatening to defrock any priest who allows a divorced Christian to remarry, the confrontation is set to escalate. Al Jazeera, Cairo.